Do you want to see my guitar cover of Shadow of Intent? What the shit is up my dudes and dudettes? Welcome, thank you for tuning in. I hope all you guys are doing awesome because on today's video, I'm reacting to some motherfucking Shadow of Intent, The Horror Within, the official music video. Now, this is a subscriber's request, uh, Zarak Asterfell. I hope I'm saying that name right. Dude, you've been commenting on all my videos, so you finally got my attention, but it was also Potato Face, Sweet username, by the way. Uh, you also said to check out this song, and you said that Currents, I think, is like the guitarist or something. And this is his other band, something like that. I don't know. I love Currents. You can check on the link above for my girlfriend reacting to Currents uh, Forever Marked. Um, Shadow of Intent, I have a good idea that it's heavy. I'm pretty sure Potato Face. <laughs> I fucking love that name. Um, I'm pretty sure you said that uh, this is really heavy and then you noticed that I did Black Tongue already. You can click on the link above for that one. Uh, that song was pretty brutal, so if this is like in the same level of heaviness, oh shit, I am pumped. I do love listening to really heavy death metal deathcore. I don't know what kind of metal this is, but if it's really heavy, I'm just going to say it's death metal. And if you're new to this channel, then welcome. I hope you're having a good time watching me. What I like to do with these videos is go into it completely blind. I don't like to do much research of the band. Afterwards, I like to like kind of review the song and talk about it afterwards, maybe even dissect the lyrics a bit. That being said, I feel like that's enough chit chat. Let's fucking do it. This song's a fucking neck breaker. Oh my god. This song is so sick. It's so fast and the riffs are so good. Oh my god. I love the super upbeat fucking blast beats and then it just brings it down for that breakdown. Let's keep going though. <laughs> What a sweet transition to that melodic scream. Holy fuck. This song just continues to surprise me. It's so good. Oh, God, those drums. Oh, this big squeal. 
Oh my god, I want to keep going, but I need to talk about how the sections in this song just continue to surprise me. It is so good. I love the little bass breaks right there back into that main riff, and the main riff is so good. And then it just that smooth transition into the solo. God damn, this is a really well written song. Really well written. So far, that was my favorite part in the whole song, that fucking melodic, uh, clean uh, saying right there. God damn, I, I really like all the screaming, and I think why I like that section so much is like, I, you needed the rest of the song to appreciate that part so much. Like, if the whole song was just like that, all that like death scream, or death growls the whole time, like, it's still good, but I... It's just like the continuous changes, like this song continues to surprise me and that's what I keep saying and that's why I love it so much right now. Holy fuck. Now that is really good metal right there. Oh my god, that was so good. Man, like how do I even begin to talk about how much I liked it? Like where do I start? Honestly, okay, like let's start with the main riff. The main riff is like sounded kind of simple, but like I love how it kind of like structured the song and they kept bringing it back, you know? Everything was so good. The the screams, the growls, it was so good. Like I said, I think the best part in this song was just like the continuous surprises where I loved it when the rest of the band let the bass have time to breathe and do the main riff. I thought that was so sweet and then it just went back into the friggin' fast like blast beats and shit. Oh my god, it was just amazing. Uh, the guitar solo was just so well written. Like I remember like instead of just being non-stop notes all over the fretboard, it actually had like a sense of melody where in the solo like it, it stopped at a certain point and then went back into like this uh, into the scale and like it just sounded so good instead of just being like crazy fast picking, you know? 
because like the rest of the song was like really fast picking other than like you know the main riff there was like a lot of tremolo picking and stuff um kind of like normal with like death metal but like i just really enjoyed the solo the drumming was just obviously relentless oh my god blast beats galore jesus christ like i don't know and like the screamer like obviously so good how does that voice like come from that dude eh just like it is guttural, demonic. When the guitarist brought in his vocals, holy shit, that was like the perfect vocal for like this band. Like imagine if it was like this poppy, you know, kind of like stuff that you hear in metalcore, kind of like a uh, clean vocal. That was like just, it would have not like contrasted well with the song, but his vocals just fit perfectly. It was like that shouty kind of singing, you know? It sounded so good. The guitar work, the drumming, the bass, the vocals, were all just top tier, like really good. The whole song was amazing. They even had keys that you could easily hear in the ending. Definite atmosphere going on in the background. They added layers to the song. It was just a really well written song. Holy shit. My only complaint with this is actually the music video itself. Like I like music videos where it shows the band. I feel like you don't need much of a story sometimes, especially when you're doing a first reaction. Like that's what I appreciate a lot is just seeing the band and getting to see like a face to behind the instruments, you know? But the music video was just kind of like, it, looked, it felt kind of awkward. I don't know, I felt like the screamer and the, the drummer just look kind of like awkward there. It has nothing to do with the band. I think it's just like the direction. The music video could have been shot a bit better, but that's my only complaint. The band was just incredible. Holy shit. Thank you so much, my dudes, for telling me to check out this song. Holy crap. Man, if it wasn't for this reaction channel, I wouldn't have found out about so many good bands. I fucking love doing this. This is so fun. I get to find so much new music because of this. It's great. Anyways, if you guys got a song recommendation for me, comment down below. Show me something nasty. Show me something spicy. Show me something melodic and catchy. I don't even give a shit. Just comment down below because I love it. But other than that, thank you for tuning in. Till next time. Peace.